walk the son of a gun. He's big and dumb as a man can come, but he's stronger than a T. Lou Wong. And when the bad trolls all get together at night, you know they all call Big Red Sly just because. And they say you don't talk of the E way, you don't hear anything. Welcome back to 10 Minutes of Shop. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, we, and, and as always, join yes. the Patreon. We just watched Jim Brewer's stand-up special. Somebody had to say it. Mm. It was uh, really bad. Like, almost, well, not almost. It was unwatchable. Oh, yeah, we stopped yeah. watching it. We stopped watching it. We couldn't get through the whole thing because yeah. it was just, uh, it was bad, mm -hmm. right? Like, a lot of animal noises and dancing and stuff and... Quacking and Broadway, farting. Yeah. quacking, farting. He talked out of his ass a lot. Not even politically, we didn't like it. It's just like, it was yeah, bad. it was just yeah. um, not for us. Yeah. But, you know, we struggle for you. We try to get through the whole thing if you want to join the Patreon. But, anyways, that's not why you're here. You're here for, as always, 10 minutes of shop. So play the chain clip, start the timer now. All righty. So we've got a, it's not, it's a light week at Chang's. Got to say, we usually oh, have yeah? like 20 clips pulled up. Today we only got, what, like 10? Yeah, well, you're a numbers guy. You yeah. expect every once in a while the kitchen's going to be... Maybe they're just making really good dishes. Yeah. It takes a bit more time yeah. to serve up the the best stuff, you know? Yeah, you know, it's it's uh, the we're in the eye of the storm, as they say. Just when you think there's not a lot happening dishes-wise, Baba does something redacted. You know, and the employment numbers haven't come out yet, so we yeah. don't know. <laughs> yeah. could be like some <laughs> unemployment going on. People got laid out of the kitchen. You know, True. We Where wish them the best of luck. Joe Rogan and Shorty Pie? Good question, B. Good you know question. I mean? Interesting. Uh, but this first one's posted by Bob Wynn 770 It's called Bapa's Celebrity Fans featuring Eminem, Travis Barker, Leonardo DiCaprio, Kanye West, and more. Compilation. You ready for this, B? Yeah. Oh, and Eminem's on Instagram, <laughs> Twitter, and social. The way he mumbles through Eminem. It's great. Yeah, I mean, I mean. It's, it's peak shop. It's one of the best parts of listening to shop because he played the audio a little bit before yeah. it started. I started laughing and he looked at me like, what? And I was like, oh, I just heard him go, man, man, man. <laughs> but I didn't know he was talking about Eminem. Yeah. Now I know it's even funny. Yeah. Social media. He's DM me. I, I had a thing with Eminem, right? I, I had a thing with up. Eminem, right? Oh, he's DMing me. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, right. Okay, so Adam Sandler. Adam Sandler goes, you're the, you're the uh, tough guy that does comedy, right? And I was like, holy fuck. <laughs> I was a fighter and he had tears in his eyes and was telling me to stop fighting. Who? Casey Affleck. Wow. <laughs> He's so redacted that Casey Affleck is stepping in. Yeah. Like, hey, you got to stop. B. He, Casey Affleck gave him the speech that Ben Affleck gives Matt Damon and Goodwill Hunting. Yeah. My dream is that one day I come here and you're gone. He's talking about UFC. <laughs> yeah. Uh, we're, we're talking Mas Manchester by the CTE, dude. Oh, you know what I'm saying, dude? Look at you. Look at you guys. <laughs> yeah. Hell yeah. Boner alert. <laughs> Very good. We for sure got a couple of boner alerts coming up. We oh. already we oh, got yeah? a little sneak preview oh, okay. of a couple of these clips, all right, dude. All right. Let's see what the rest of this one has, though. He was oh. like, you don't need to do this, man. Yeah. You have so much going for you. You're a smart kid. But I didn't recognize that first. I'm like, that guy looks like Adam. So I was waiting. <laughs> Adam Sandler again. Yeah, I wasn't sure if it was Adam Sandler, the most <laughs> famous comedian of all time. Then I realized it was, and he loves me. You know what's so funny is Nick Swartzen is like Adam Sandler's best friend, one of them. I'm oh, assuming. yeah, he's like one of the guys. Yeah, one of the he's guys. Probably, he's looking at Bapa like right now like, you don't even know how much <laughs> shit this fool talks about you, dude. It looks like he went on a bender and Shab bringing up Adam Sandler is making it harder for him to focus. <laughs> he's more hungover. Yeah. <laughs> and he came up to me. I was at the comedy store. Two nights before, and I think he was around then. He came up to me and was like, You're that funny guy that kicks ass. Wait, what? He's saying that Leonardo oh, I DiCaprio. I did it in my special. We know because we watched that on Patreon too. Yeah. Another hard one to get through. Yeah, but uh, it was very hard. Actually, I was uh, looking forward to it. It's just like so upsetting how hard it was to actually watch. Yeah, it wasn't like the Gringo Poppy where every time you watch it is immediate joy. Yeah, but there's it was no Mr. Whole Foods. There's nothing no. like that. Yeah, other no, than Asian and shit, which 
Yeah, and, and uh, Jamal. Well, that's the Jamal one, but also that's also um, you know worst pain in your life, which oh, is yeah. amazing. Same bit. Yeah, uh, Jamal. But well, also there's two difference haircut and the doctor. Yeah, yeah. The turkeys. That's I you like, like that. that. Yeah, I don't yeah, know why. Yeah. That was so <laughs> funny, dude. <laughs> that's your narrative. <laughs> well, it's such a shop thing. Oh, yeah. it's like, oh, yeah. oh, very funny. I don't get it. Greatest joke I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> All right. But uh, and then we also fact check it, and Leonardo DiCaprio wasn't there. Yeah, we read the Wicked or whatever it was. It was the, on the Changs. The Changs, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I go to SB like Super. <laughs> <laughs> Hanging out, just best buds. Wait, what did we say on the on the review? Is that it was Leonardo DiCaprio, uh, somebody else, two other people, but really it was three C grade celebrities. I think that we said I, I might be wrong, but I think what we said was that wouldn't it be funny if it wasn't Leonardo DiCaprio? And it was somebody that's just so different. Like it was Don Cheadle. Oh yeah, Don yeah. Cheadle. And I was like, oh <laughs> dude, Leonardo DiCaprio was there. It's like what? <laughs> <laughs> that was Don Cheadle, dude. You remember War Machine from <laughs> yeah. Adventures? Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's see. Ball party with Tim Tebow. We walk in, and then Michael Irvin's there, like surrounded by a ton of people. You know, he's the life of the party. Like, and he sees me and goes, "Shab, yeah. Shab, get over here, baby." I'm like, "Oh, what's up, baby?" You know, and there's all these people. I go to grab his hand, and he grabs my head, holds me down, and kisses the top of my head in front of everybody. How do you know him, Dick? Uh, we did the 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 tournament together, the oh. charity tournament together. But I still <laughs> fucked. With oh my god, dude! Besides the kissing part of it, I think I find it funny that these celebrities are having the same reactions that we would. Yeah, it's almost like he's describing what we would do. Yeah, like, oh yeah. my god, yes! Yeah. Oh my god, I'm such a huge fan. Yeah, you're that fighter that does bad at comedy. Yeah, dude. yeah, I probably wouldn't say that, but and then I would be so amped, bro, if I met Shav and he was yeah. like, "How are you doing today?" I'd be like, eight inches, dude." And I knew, <laughs> it. I knew <laughs> it, bro. Hit him with a Shav. Yes, it. yeah, eight inches. Good <laughs> morning, Mister Shav. <laughs> Name the movie. <laughs> All right, let's see. Because Travis Barker's my boy. Travis, one of the yeah, best Travis, people the, I know. Uh, the, the, Travis is literally one of the best people on earth, and he fucks with him. Mm-hmm. So I gotta imagine yeah. he's a good person. Thanks for that follow, Travis. <laughs> Rick Ross texts me because he, he, Rick Ross. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I feel like Shab has a very vivid imagination. I mean, I'm not really you know finding gold here. You yeah. know what I mean? I feel like he he meets these people. It's just not in real life. You know what I mean? It's I really don't know. I yeah. don't know what to believe and what not to believe. I want the names to get more crazy though, like cancelable names. Like he's like Bashar Al Assad was texting me the other day, and yeah. he was just like, "Man, I love your show." <laughs> Yeah. Dude, Benjamin Netanyahu said that I had a lot to do with. <laughs> well, you know, how do you know Prince, uh, President Benjamin Netanyahu? Uh, well, you know, we were at, we did that charity thing together, you know, <laughs> raise money for the Palestinians. Yeah. And, what? <laughs> yeah. Dude, you're not going to believe it. I was at uh, O'Reilly's Auto Parts, ran into Shamu. <laughs> I was like, have you seen this blackfish? Doctor? I thought you were gonna say um <laughs> you said O'Reilly's auto parts and he saw redact that he was like, and Bill O'Reilly was there, you know, because he like owns the yeah. all that stuff. And I was like, What's up, Bill? He's like a huge fan. Look at you guys. <laughs> he said, Let's go to your show. Fuck it, we'll do it live. He told me that. I was over there, no. I saw ISIS. I was like, Look at you guys. <laughs> he met ISIS. ISIS watches us. <laughs> Talking about uh Yeah, how crazy is that? I can't believe I just that's 2023 for you. Rick Ross DM me. Sorry, I didn't text. DM me and has this. And, uh, so I'm about fish tanks. I'm ballsy with fish tanks. <laughs> and uh, we posted about yeah. it. He must have saw it because he DM me. I told you when I was. <laughs> Celebs are going for fish advice for Brennan Schaub because they know he's the fish guy. Oh, my God. He's such a cute <laughs> adolescent man, dude. Yeah. That doesn't sound real for if sure. If these are all real, he lives a fucking great life, dude. How would they know that he's really into fish? Because they his social media presence, dude, his engagement numbers. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah. yeah. He's a numbers guy, B. Maybe. Rick Ross hit him up and like, hey, man, you really eat that fish? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's why they're, they secretly want to know if he bit the fish. Yeah. All these celebrities are certified homeless. <laughs> Let's see. Just working the Logan Paul Floyd Mayweather fight. I went to the restaurant and his whole team, all, all of them, all of them were coming out. 
And he goes, I know you, you're the white boy who works too much. <laughs> that's me, dude. Oh, is that right? Yeah, that's me, dude. Wow. So you're all <laughs> that's me, dude. That's me, dude. <laughs> Just classic. That was a special time, that clip. Yeah. Thank him. Over, man. I'm like, yeah, I'm exhausted. How no? tall is <laughs> The Rock? 6'2". <laughs> yeah, no. The Rock. Okay, <laughs> wait. First of all, I wanted to, I don't know if you're okay with this. I can cut this out if you're not. What? Uh, we have, there's a debate going on at Timo Studios, right? You oh. know what I'm talking about here, dude. Um, what are these fine gentlemen sitting in, dude? Oh, the chairs. Yes. Oh, and yeah, chairs be. Um, Ch- chairs. We, these are the old chairs that uh, TFAT K sat in. We're trying to find new chairs because our chairs are uncomfortable as fuck. Yeah. And uh, I looked up the new ones. I was thinking about getting some movie chairs, but I like. I guess I like these better. What's the debate we're having? The debate is the old brown rustic looking chairs or the new movie red kind of old school. This is like uh, phase two TF, TFAT K red chair. Remember how like they used to have the red chairs. They got rid of them for these brown redacted ones. Right. And then now they brought back the red ones. So I'm just saying in the comments, you know what I mean? Comment below. Which ones do you want to see us uh, sitting in? Oh, yeah. And we'll probably do something redacted like get blue chairs. But still, <laughs> yeah. you know what I mean? <laughs> we'll put these on them. Yeah. <laughs> we'll soundproof the chairs. <laughs> yeah, put anything in here. I'll soundproof. Yeah. But yeah, let us know in the comments. How no. tall is <laughs> The Rock? The Rock. 6'2". Yeah, I'm, no. el- yeah. I'm in the elevator. You're in the elevator. You're in the elevator. Until he is like, I just don't believe it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, really, dude? <laughs> just two of us out of, out of Did you say anything? Fight. Just what's up? What's up, The Rock? A fan. <laughs> Big fan. He said what? He said he's a fan. I said, I want to fucking fight you. He's not. I, all of that sounds made up. Yeah, our phones is <laughs> all. <of> that sounds <laughs> made up. <laughs> Oops. Oh, so this is T. Lawan. Which one is it? The one on the right. Okay, the one to the far right is T. Lawan. Yeah, and then the other one's Compton. Will Compton. Yeah. Okay. T. Lawan got a shout out in a, a Timo song, dude. Yes, he did. Hell yeah, dude. Yeah, yeah. You go on T. Fat K. Make one of the songs be maybe. Boner alert. Order that. <laughs> Let's see. Oscar party and everyone's uh, in tuxedos. Yeah, yeah. So it, no, there's mm-hmm. no cell phone. Tuxedos. I've been to those parties. And Will Smith asked me to. Uh, <laughs> Will Smith asked me if I did private training. <laughs> he did. Who? Mm-hmm. Will Smith was like, "Hey man, you know the reason why you punched Buddy in the face? Okay. Yo, he did the reason he training. slapped old boy. Oh, I didn't train. You're with the reason why Chris Rock. No, I didn't train with him. He I did didn't train with him. Take him up on it. I get different vibes. What'd you say, dude? Those. I know I, I'm a one I'm a one track mind kind of guy, right? Those sure. fucking chairs right there, be you know what I mean? Those are fluffy. I mean, they look comfortable, and movie chairs traditionally are you know comfortable yeah, as fuck. So yeah, they're in the running, and we did find ones that have the cup holders, but they're very expensive. Very expensive. And the brown rustic chair that we found does look almost exactly like. I mean, you'll be the judge if we end up picking those, but yeah, I feel like the one you found looks exactly like it. It had two negative reviews. That said, it was one of them said it was the most uncomfortable chair that they've ever sat in. So I don't know if I want to buy it, but I mean, yeah. they had mostly good reviews. There was yeah. only two negative. So we'll see. <laughs> I'm not sure. But w- when most of the five star reviews are bots, and then there's oh. two for real ones that How are do like, you know that? please do not. Because they're like, oh, great chair. I've bought it. I sat on it. Great quality. And then there's some that are just five stars with no review. Mm-hmm. Every one star review has passion behind it, dude. You know what I mean? Different kind of capitalization and stuff like that. Hmm. Yeah. I want to get the, a review straight from the source, though. You know what I mean? Yeah, ask them. Yeah. Yeah. Brian, what chair should we get? Brian? <laughs> yeah. He's like, you guys suck. <laughs> Stop <laughs> making you fun do? of me. <laughs> Stop making fun of the show. How about that? Yeah. He probably beat us up. Yeah. I'd rather meet Chubb. No. I'm going to hold mitts for you? You, you didn't say no. To I promise you. I was a guy. Well, at the time, as a current UFC fighter, fight. I'm like, oh, I don't, I don't like hold mitts, dog. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> Imagine having to break it down to Will Smith. Like, I'm, I, dude, I love you, but I don't hold mitts, dude. <laughs> I would hold mitts for uh, Will Smith. I'd be like, sure. Yeah, dude. Yeah. I don't know. Why would that be? If you're going to train him. Yeah. Well, I guess he doesn't want to train him. So. Yeah. Well, if Will Smith came up to me, he was like, what are we doing here, dude? You hold mitts or not? I'm be like, oh, dude, yeah. for sure. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely, dude. Just don't slap Chris Rock, whatever you do. Yeah. That was blocked. Have you met Kanye? <laughs> Kanye. Yes. <laughs> he doesn't want to lie. It's like he's <laughs> he's trying to put the speed bumps on the lie, dude, but he can't. <laughs> they all are just staring, waiting for him to lie. Yeah. Like he has to lie during the show at least once. They're like, and would you like to lie now? 
What about him, dude? What about him? Are you talking to him? Spend time with him? He knows who you are? I doubt it. <laughs> just a white boy with a face, man. <laughs> okay, that's how you said, huh? Right? Change of the narrative. Interesting end. What do you think is happening behind the scenes here? Because that last one is a there's a there's an obvious difference between all the celebrities he named and then Kanye West with Brian being somewhat more. Oh, you know what I mean? Yeah, you got the best brains. I didn't see it, but now that you say it out loud, yeah. So all the people that are cool, he's met. Yeah. But the guy who's had some mistakes lately doesn't know who he is because Brendan Schaub is a white boy with a face. <laughs> yeah. Maybe he has met him. Yeah. That's what the truth. Like the only one he's met is the guy that's going out there talking about Jews. <laughs> And you didn't want to say that, but that's not what I meant. But oh. uh, yeah, what did you mean? I meant like uh, I feel like Brian Callen is like, oh, really? You met? Let's hear it. Tell me what you think about Kanye. You've met him, right? That kind of uh-huh. thing, because there's so much evidence of him faking the celebrity encounter. Oh, so Brian's being a little bit changey, certified homeless. I <laughs> said it. I said it probably thirty episodes ago, dude. I don't get that vibe from Brian at all. Uh-huh. I would think he wants to kill people at Chang's, probably. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, you know what I'm saying? I'm the devil's advocate, dude. Yeah. Or however for shot would say. <laughs> All right. Let's go to the next one, man. These are the most uh, popular clips of the week. Shout out to haphazard, dude. He's got yeah. one of the most popping clips of the week. Haven't seen it yet. One of our guys. Yes. One of our guys. A uh, great guy. Never met him. There is an interview with him on the Patreon, though. Yes, there is. Uh, this one's called Chris realizes that his co-host does not understand comedy. <laughs> Let's see. No, but the thing is, this, look, look, if you, if the story is so outdated, then make a new story. Yeah. But not call it Snow White. No, no, but they, it's like, there's nothing wrong with like, we, no, yeah, we like this. They so, should have so, called her Snow Brown, honestly. Yeah, they, exactly. Snow Black. That could have been cool. Snow, Snow Brown. Brown. That's what I said. Snow Brown. Snow, 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 Snow Black. Snow right? Brown is better. Don't make the joke worse <laughs> by tagging it worse. Well, no, you want Snow Black. <laughs> Why? Because explain why, yeah, yeah, because <laughs> you, you want views, right? Yeah, uh-huh. snow black, like it's very it's exaggerated. Brown, that could be anything. Is she Indian? But that's why it's snow brown. You don't know what she is. Oh, fuck, dude. We want black. What? <laughs> 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 snow mix, snow, snow mix, mix snow, mixed um, snow. That'd be the name of it. Ooh. But, but that's coming to how Fox. about just rain. You know? Dude, I. <laughs> <laughs> it's almost like they're ten minutes of shot for a second there. Yeah. Like Chris is like at first he's sort of frustrated and angry, but then he just starts laughing because it's so absurd. <laughs> he's we realize he's not going to be able to explain to Brennan what's going on. <laughs> yeah. Brennan's just stuck on snow black, whatever that means to him. I know, dude. You know, it's sort of like talking to a little kid, and you go, "Hey, you got to get back. The, you put the toys away. It's time to go to bed." And they don't understand. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I'm more of a Black Swan kind of guy. You like Natalie Portman? Of course. Oh, yeah, dude. Great movie. Have you seen it? Never seen it. <laughs> All right. Let's so redact it, dude. <laughs> yeah. All right. So this next one's posted by Busy underscore Middle 8108. It's called Rinks has definitely been in Chang's recently. What I was saying uh, did his <laughs> utmost to bait Brenda into another celebrity lie. Okay. This, oh, this okay. might be the Kanye Okay. One. So there's a narrative there. W- with a little bit more uh, context. I don't think he comes around. To you know, you know the other Kardashians yep. a little bit. Yeah. I don't think he comes around to the family functions. He doesn't like what they're about. Hmm. Good for him. <laughs> that's how he feels. Doesn't want to be on camera. Yeah. That's all. That's a, that's stress pounds, but. Do you know, have you, have you met Kanye? <clears throat> <clears throat> yes. What about him, dude? Have you talked to him, spent time mm-hmm. with him? Mm-hmm. He knows who you are? I doubt it. Probably just a white boy with a face, man. Or he might. <laughs> oh. I'm not Jewish, so he talks to me. Oh. Uh, <laughs> set up for there a bad go. joke. There you go. True. New stand-up bit? What else you got, Jen? Oh, All my right. God. I said, what got what the in, fuck, dude? dude? <laughs> I mean, I didn't. Re- I didn't guess. I I didn't catch the first one. He does say yes at, b- at the beginning. My bad. I didn't see that. But the way he says it is kind of like we talked about this. I'm gonna always say I met whatever celebrity comes up. He's dude. met everybody. I mean, he's a very famous guy. <laughs> yeah. right? Do you think that bit could be funny? Which bit? Like we every episode of Raccoon Tweeties, we just talk about a celebrity we didn't meet, like we met them. You know what I mean? I don't understand. Exactly. Why does Shab do it? <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, well, like, let's say on Raccoon Tweeties, I'm just like, oh, dude, Justin Long stopped by the apartment yesterday, dude. He told me he's a big fan of Raccoon Tweeties. <laughs> oh, I, but we, you're saying like they did as a joke. They never met me, but I'm like, in real life. Yeah. yeah. I, that's why I misunderstood. Um, 
Let the listeners vote. Is that funny? I don't know. Talk about what do you, which chair do you want? We'll pick the chair. We'll I'm just getting mad. <laughs> I get fake mad. Um, no, it could be. Yeah, sure. Well, Let's, when we, we should just do it and then not say anything yeah. about it. When we try to pick the chair, though, we sit here for three hours looking at chairs. That's true. Yeah. There was a lot of chairs going through Amazon, <laughs> Home Depot, and and Wayfair. It's fucking midnight, and we're barely starting to record. <laughs> <laughs> All we right. We need help. We need help. Oh, shit, dude. Haphazard has a great week. Uh, this is another haphazard one. It's called Callan Finally Speaks the Truth. Callan, I'm telling you, he's off his rocker, dude. No, it's not real. And you're also lying. Well, you don't think Hawaii would be upset at that? I think you're a fat liar. Just <laughs> like you said, you saw fucking mountain, mountain lions. lions. Yeah. <laughs> Dang, naming the waters. I'm a fat liar. Fat Patrick is doing a little bit of Theo's bit there. Have you seen him like do his little tirade on this episode yet? No, not yet. No. Oh, dude, that's a, that's a clip coming up later. B, what would you think I about still, that? One? Yeah, I still don't think that he's like secretly homeless or anything like that. Really? No. Dude, let me. I'm gonna go straight to this fucking clip then right now. Uh, okay. No, not this one. Oh, okay. Here we go. Another one from Haphazard, dude. Uh, a lot of truth in this bit. <laughs> I like the title. <laughs> Quote unquote bit. And then the, the, what's the tag? Redact whisper. <laughs> Redact whisper. <laughs> All right, here it goes. This may sound inappropriate, but I got a boner that could blunt a cat's claw. You know what I mean? Uh, I'll tell yeah. you why. Because <laughs> Brendan's wearing a little. <laughs> had Wait, to do, it, had to it, do it. Do it. <laughs> I mean, that was like, you know. Dude, if it wasn't for the soundproofing, we couldn't have that voice thing. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah biker cap and it makes his head look extra small <laughs> and let's be honest the top of his head is extra small is he doesn't have much small. of a brain you know what i mean <laughs> he's got a big body with a small head and a tiny dick you know what i'm saying all right guys let's hear it for my boner right now which could cut a diamond is Ooh. he do is he doing a bit for us i don't know that's crazy yeah that is like is he doing an and that's almost like not Changs, that's almost Timos. <laughs> but no one knows who we are. We don't matter, but yeah. that was wild cuz that's like his writing voice, you know? Like yeah. that stupid ass speech he did with Crowder. I feel bad bashing him now that he's <laughs> performing for us. But that is like that stupid voice that he has and he did it. <laughs> Let's see. If he said something about a duck or a hawk, then he's watching. Oh. I don't know why, but I am hard as it gets. And speaking of hard, I'll take you from here, pilot fish. How about you suck me off at the commercial break? Yeah, don't, <laughs> don't call me a pilot fish, you stupid son of a bitch. You're a fat fucking whale, and you're gonna die soon. I'm gonna outlive you. But you've been you falling gonna... this whale, you pilot fish, and I'm getting sick of it. That's true, but I'll be dancing on your grave, you piece of fucking shit. You're a big old mud pie, you overgrown whale. And I hope you sink to the Let's bottom. Let's cut of the, the break. Okay, well we're not that mean. <laughs> yeah, we yeah. like shop. Yeah. <laughs> now think... I'm just confused. I don't. No. Well, the discourse on the Discord, which join it, it's free if you want to, mm. is people saying that they got rid of the no cussing sign. Oh, yeah. so they're oh, sh- it's always I mean? more redacted than you think. Yeah. There's <laughs> nothing like smart. It's like they're just ugh. So that whole clip <laughs> is just them not cursing. Yeah. That makes me feel sad. Oh no, that whole clip is them cussing. They got rid of the no cursing sign. Remember last week they had a no cursing sign, so they would bleep things. And then they would oh, reference the thing. Oh, so they're cursing because that's even worse. Dude, you're the worst brain for the arts. I know. I, 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 I totally missed all the curse <laughs> words there. I totally missed. Can we watch it again? Oh, my God. I just closed it. Let right, me. Fuck it. Uh, we'll go back to it. Yeah. Uh, as a little topper off, as a nightcap for this episode, we'll watch it again. Okay. But let's get to some more pressing things, dude. This one's uh, posted by Sir underscore stripper underscore Bill. Never seen that name before. It's called I Wonder Who He's Talking About. Most likely Baba. I re- you remember this is like uh was it like a month ago or something like that? Oh yeah. Uh, you texted me or I texted you congratulating you that uh for the club opening. It was like right around when it opened and uh you texted me back uh I can wait for you to come see it. Which I think you meant to say I can't wait yeah, for you to come I'm see sure. it. But I thought there was something so <laughs> funny about just texting me like I was if that was your way of telling me you don't want me at the club. You like, <laughs> I can I can wait. I can wait for you to see it actually. Oh, that's hilarious. It's it has been a problem though cuz oh. pe- you know, a lot of people want to come. And some of them are just, you know, it, people are weird like that that want a headline and you know that they know like you know that you're not really a headliner. <laughs> like what are you talking about? Oh mm-hmm. yeah, <laughs> this is like an old the spicy dish that got re served, refried. Right? But I saw it on the Changs, like. But yeah, classic. Obviously, talking about Babacito. Yeah, Brenda, Brenda Schlaub. Well, let's be honest, dude. Great dish. 
right? Yeah, no, classic. I, very, very well prepared. I can eat that seven days a week. <laughs> Sorry about that. I had to burp real quick. Um, this one's posted by All I Do Is Lie to You. It's called Bapa Prophecy. It looks like a see the old school. Oh, dude, look at those chairs. Okay, you so those I mean? are even. That's a third version. Yeah, that we could do that. Kind of looks like one of the chairs that we had. Comment below. Let us know. Vote. Let's see. <laughs> vote on the chairs. Which one do you want? <laughs> now take this. Now take this clip. Fast forward a year from now. Brendan's not showing up. Shab is not here. History in the making. <laughs> First golden hour with no Shab. Yep. Brendan's dead broke. I didn't yeah. say a fucking thing. That's going to stay But the fact 14, that, like, you guys are fucking still, yeah, still, alive. still doing it. Yeah, yeah I know. <laughs> still doing it and crushing it. Yeah. Thanks. And when Absolutely you, we're doing it. Right. And when yeah. you came through Nashville. I'm on some hard time. Hey, uh, it's not good. No. Here's grown out. Let's <laughs> go. <laughs> cool. Yep. I'm Venice Beach. Doing this a lot. <sighs> Could happen. Bro, I was taking these, five of these fucking bro, things. Bro, I was your taking mouth. three 30 milligram bottles <laughs> a day for. Hey, you, a take lot. Ten, you take 10, you're fucked. That's a lot. It is Monday morning, <laughs> 9 o'clock a.m. on this beautiful, crisp <laughs> Calabasas morning. How's everybody doing? Great. Who could and then you that? rob me? <laughs> Chris, dude. Chris is one of my favorite. Yeah. From the early. Actually, I don't remember when it was. I just remember we laughed a lot about the Chris. Yes. It was like Monday morning? I yeah. just remember the Chris part. Chris Monday morning. Chris. <laughs> just rob me? You just. You no, no, I'll be, like, be like guy who hustled you. Like, dude, you know I get good for me. I was wondering how you want to get that $5,000 to me. I sent you to uh, the cash app. The night when once you text me, I said I didn't that. get it. Yeah, I didn't I get on my cash app. Yeah, Did you? Yeah, I didn't yeah. see that. Yes, yeah, I got it. You sent it to me. Yeah, I sent it. Now there's a limit on there, so it's going to come in. That's two what I mean. Now here's the pro- I knew it. I I, yeah, I need <laughs> listen to me. Now here now. What here, did you send here, me? Because I don't like now, getting paid in increments. Well, he, the juice is running. But here's the, the thing, Dad. Here's the thing. You ain't trying to do double or nothing. That being said, you want to bet on it, huh? You want to bet on it? I'll bet you. It, again, it's not a bad bet at all. You want to bet a thousand dollars? Sure. <laughs> how, how about I don't owe you if it goes to a decision? Because it's not fair. Like it's a, almost a minus four hundred. Death by a thousand cuts. <laughs> <laughs> well, Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Hot chip. I forgot also about that clip. The yeah. death by a thousand cuts. Maybe he is a little bit homeless. I take it all back. Dude, he's homeless as fuck. Yeah. He's but just, I feel like he's such an angry guy. Yeah. If only he was homeless pre LA Times. You know uh, what I'm saying? Right. Right, right, right. We all know what that means. Yeah. Gadoosh. Gadoosh. We got our song Gadoosh. Yes. <laughs> the song that we think is good, but no one else does. <laughs> oh, man. Here we go. Um, this one's posted by Pharrell 80s. It's called Remem- Reminder of That Time Brendan Burst into Logan Paul's Dressing Room, Where He At with a Camera Crew. Unannounced? <laughs> Is that a shopism? Uh, just after a fight. Unspenounced. <laughs> he like the clips of Brandon walking around in any kind of studio are always gold. It's <laughs> yeah. so funny to just to see him in studios walking around, walking around in the wild. Yeah. <laughs> Is he gonna? Was he gonna do? Film a promo? <laughs> embarrass someone? Do some stupid bit? You don't know. No matter what, he's on creative. He just goes. Let's see. <laughs> yes. So win. What the fuck, Brandon? <laughs> what the fuck? fuck? It's a win! It's a win! What's wrong with you guys? I don't know. What? I don't know. It's not. This is fucking crazy. You're fucking alien. I don't know. <laughs> that's what he said. Here, here, here's what's so crazy. That so that that so, so the f- first two he's feeling out. That fourth, fifth, and sixth. He that's the best he has trying to take you out. Just fucking chill. Unreal. You guys should be fucking stoked. I don't know what to do, bro. <laughs> he's not stoked. Yet. All right. All right. <laughs> stoked. You guys be stoked. Yeah. Bro. Oh, it's not even the studio. It's a boxing thing. Yeah. It's after one of his fights. I think after Floyd Mayweather. Uh, Brandon was there? I guess. Whoa. Let's be honest, dude. He was definitely there. And it says after a fight. I'm really not listening when I Yeah, what's it. the matter, dude? <laughs> I think that uh, that headband is cir- it's, uh, cutting, yeah, cutting out the circulation <laughs> yeah. of my brain. All right. Let's go to this one here. Oh, Minimum Sky 2305. He's back, dude, with the, t- uh, the flare Thick Boy oh. Squad, Thick Boy Nation. It's called Brian Walks Off. Let's see what this is about. 
No, I, I'm gonna go tell him to shut the fuck. It's very faint though. What? Who the fuck Why knows? Why did he the cops up? not because let it's a, people it's a leave? Shut the fuck up, right? No, it's this loud, guy right? is having a a <laughs> fucking Brian Sorry. is cr <laughs> Brian no, is cr Brian. Yeah, one hundred percent. I'm not doing this. Okay, bye. Have a great day. I killed both of them. Good. We're safe. Good. No, <laughs> Brian literally walked off the set. Why? He was like, I'm done with this Why show. Why was he mad? Because uh, Sam saying, you know, the guy who was in charge of the Hawaii fires was, was, was supposed to set the alarm to let everybody know. Uh -huh. He didn't set the alarm so, like, more people died because they, oh. didn't, they, didn't, they weren't aware of it. Okay. And Sam saying that guy was, was responsible for the Vegas shootings, <laughs> earthquakes. Oh, and, How does oh. Brian get sucked into an argument like that? But my thing is, why does he get so mad? You know what you signed up Th that's for? That's what I'm saying. It'd be like me going to Snow White being like, what the fuck? Yeah, but I would just... She's not white! <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> yeah, but like you... Just <laughs> Eric, I knew it, dude. That's so funny. <laughs> is, he is he saying I knew it because Brennan's racist? <laughs> because or Brennan's a hack, dude. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let's see the rest of this. Sam says that, and you go like this. Oh, you think that? And he says, yeah. And you go, oh, wow. Yeah. I would never engage with that. Right. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Diddler's the voice of reason <laughs> yeah, in this dude. studio. Well, dude, he's got years of therapy, dude. Right. He was before that. He wasn't even really a person. Yeah. Now, no. now he's now he's ready to not engage with uh, conspiracy theories like that. I'm sorry. I said it wrong. It's therapy. Therapy. Oh, yeah. right, right, right. I was trying to do a shopism. I, I just looked more redacted. Dude, that's pretty crazy, right? I can see myself ha that happening to me. If I get into an argument, I might get too worked up and be like, yeah. And then I'm at the end of it, I'm like, God damn it. Why did I engage? Yeah. But yeah, no, I, that's actually one of the most normal things we've seen Brian do. I mean, dude, why is this week so Brian heavy? I don't know. That's crazy, man. I feel yeah. bad for the cat. Not. <laughs> it's a, like a cyber attack or a psyop yeah. to make the show worse. <laughs> Have just Brian instead of Scoob. It's just like it's so crazy how I'm pissed off Brian or Brendan is obviously. You know, I'm gonna go tell him to shut the fuck. Up. It's very faint though. Who the fuck Why knows? Why did he the cops up? not because let it's a, people it's a leave? Shut the fuck up, right? No, it's this loud, guy right? is having a a fuck. <laughs> yeah, dude, I don't even know, dude. That's, yeah, that's crazy, ridiculous, bro. Anything else? No, I mean that's a crazy conspiracy theory. It's wild. I'm just going to walk yeah, off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you walk off because you believe it so hard. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, dude. <laughs> all right, let's go to the next clip. Uh, Minimum Sky, great chef. Dude, never met him. Yeah. Um, all right, this one's posted by Ryan Joseph 82 Is he one of our guys? Yeah, Ryan. Yes. He's, he's Sometimes he's on the live chats. All right, like one of nice our guy. guys, dude. Eric Griffin is not a fan of Shab's new haircut. Is this one? Let's see. Hey, hey, you have a weird fade right now. And you yeah. have the nerve to talk about hair. Okay, <laughs> bro, bro, that shit looks like you go like this at night. Bro, you. What? Jamal's watching. Like, be cool. Be cool, Montez. <laughs> be cool. Jamal's watching. Pissed. He's like, yeah, that's why he should come to me. <laughs> He's been back. Yeah. With Jerry curl on your fucking knuckles. But I can <laughs> shave this. <laughs> can you? This isn't a choice. You chose this haircut. <laughs> <laughs> That's a point. choice. <laughs> you think I. Do you think somebody wrote that for him, Shab? Because he knew he was going to get made fun of the hair. Yeah. He's like, give me something to make fun of them. <laughs> yeah. He probably has a Dalia thing, too. Yeah. Are you, a, are, you, are you a man with hairy knuckles? No, huh? I'm hairy everywhere else. Yeah. Yeah, but not, I guess, not the knuckles. I had to look. I didn't even know. I'm a I'm a hairy knuckle guy. I recently cut mine. It's already grown back, dude. Oh, okay. But roast me. I've never it. noticed. No? Oh, right. that's fucking... I think that's more of a roast than anything. That I didn't know what your hands look like? Yeah. I don't know. I think it's pretty normal. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's see the rest of this. You think I was like, yeah, give me the hairy knuckles? No. You went no, to the barber no, and was like, get, no, just shave the side no, and give leave me the, the hairiest knuckles. <laughs> you went like this. I'll, I'll take a jerry curl on my knuckles, please. <laughs> you went like you, this. You they're both roasting him. He's trying to come back. They're like a team. They're yeah. ne no one's ever on Shab's side. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, Shab's very combative. That's true. Yeah. Can I get Patrick Swayze on top? Hey, can, can, can you, can on you the perm side? my hands? <laughs> can you perm? I have curly hair. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> Such a bad diss. Can you Ugh. curl my hands? And he's laughing and no one else is. But when the Shab stuff comes in, they both laugh because it's funny. Also, Eric or uh, Chris is over here trying to roast too, but he's like, I, I can't do anything. Uh, 
He's not loud enough to get over yeah. Chubb's interruptions. Yeah, his therapist told him, don't cut people off. He's like, all <laughs> right, all right, I'm trying, I'm trying. That'd be so funny if uh, Dilly as a uh, therapist talks to him about Chubb. <laughs> God, I hope they do. He's like, but how's that? Because the rest of the stuff is too sad to talk about. He's like, how's yeah. that That guy at work, that, that crazy white boy that works too much, who interrupts you all the time? I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> Oh, really, dude? <laughs> He met Leonardo DiCaprio. <laughs> Nobody <laughs> believes anything he says. Nobody believes him. All right. So this next one's posted by the All ID Dollar. I think it's like a the Almighty Dollar with some stuff missing. It's called Bapa is on Bill Burr's radar. I was excited for this one. Let's see. No, but they do say <laughs> no. They say count sheep, not counting sheep. Yeah, one well, of my thing is not though, in my house. <laughs> my thing is my favorite thing is people not only fucking up sayings but combining them. Oh my! This is like, like you're, you're not the smart. He's he's not the smartest. He's not the smartest tool in the shed. Yeah. It's the latest one I had. It's not the uh, sharpest tool in the shed. Right. This or what <laughs> someone <laughs> says. It's not rockets. In anything. You're talking about a guy who's already lost his ability to make a living from Mexican dick pills. Like, why would he ever just take something off the shelf at GNC? Well, we're we're not giving the guy kudos because he's the smartest tool in the shed. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> <laughs> look at <Rogan's> face. <laughs> He's so happy. He's like, yes, yes. Another hilarious thing. This freaking ridiculous friend of mine has said to me. What is it? The smartest crayon in the box, or is it, what is sharpest it? tool in the shed? No, but the other one. He's mixing two. Oh, um, the smartest kid in school, or what? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> um, we're just as redacted. We're like one level less redacted, yeah. dude. Yeah, let's see. <laughs> the smartest tool in the shed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, I could use that with you all the time. I was like, are you heading to Brendan's? Yeah, but, you know, I'm going to be a little late. He's not the smartest tool in the shed. <laughs> I mean, definitely on some of the clips today, that would be accurate. <laughs> yeah, let's see. Sharpest. Sharpest tool what I say. Shed. Smartest tool in the shed. Well, tools are smart, too. <laughs> tools tools are are smart. That even sounds like something I would say after getting it wrong. I'd be like, tools are smart, trying to save myself. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I love it. Yeah, no, I th- I mean, that would be amazing if Burr knew about this. Yeah. <laughs> dude, Burr, confirmed homeless. Dude, come on the show, bro. Yeah, come on the show. <laughs> come to the east side, Billy. <laughs> yeah. All right, so this one is a picture, but I thought it was hilarious. Oh. It's posted by Khabib Time, and it's uh, John Africa. It's a picture Man. of John Jones and Brendan Schaub, dude. So does John Jones know about the John Africa thing? Probably, right? Got to know about it. Because his face, when he's smiling like that, he's almost yeah. like, eh, eh. He's like, you know, you know what I'm saying. Dude. If I were him, I would love this picture. I would yeah. t- look at, look, I finally got a pic. You know, look, at he's the guy that called me John Africa. Yeah. You know, sending all my friends. And everyone's like doing the happy, <laughs> or I mean the laughy face. The or skull whatever. emojis. The skull emojis. Yeah. Uh, dead. I think he has to know, right? Because it's an interview with Mike Tyson and like. And, and, and Ganu, yeah. Dude, if there was an interview with Mike Tyson and then my name came up, I'd be like, oh, I got to check that out. Oh, yeah. You know what I mean? For sure. Yeah. And Plus, he was going to almost fight that guy until Francis left the UFC. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it looks like in his face. He knows. Yeah, dude. All right. Let's go to the next one here. This one's called, uh, they are sure to grow their audience with content like this. <laughs> Dude, haphazard's all over the sub this week. Oh. Shout out to haphazard. Let's see this one. Get hell. Insane, dude. Uh, that's it. That's it. Yeah, I take a piss. He is hopefully I gotta take hell. a piss. All right, let's... Uh, <laughs> <break> <laughs> <a bit. laughs> I, I gotta go fart. Yeah. <laughs> Look how intense he is into this discussion with his hands out and everything, and he just goes from that to piss. Get hell. Insane, dude. Uh, that's it. That's it. Yeah, I take a piss. He is <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, let's uh, break. Take a piss. Let's move on from serial <laughs> killer talk. Seat. Sorry, everybody. How many times is sorry, <laughs> everybody? <laughs> Stop drinking all those rain energy drinks, dude. <laughs> and then Dr Pepper. Yeah. There's a, there's a curveball. No diet coke tonight. <laughs> I know, dude. I I just uh, re-upped on my diet coke, and he's not drinking any anymore. Also, wear the shoes. Yeah. Where where's your favorite shoe? I mean, did you notice the shoes he was wearing? No. All right. Christmas guess, shoes? Or guess the, the colors. Christ- red and green? Mm, one of us is right. Yeah. Green, yellow, fucking, I forget. Oh, it was yellow? Like, look he at, does do a lot of yellow shoes. Let's see this one more time. And one of the clips he's wearing. Red, no, that. it's like red and green. Oh, green is red. Yeah, You're yeah. right, dude. I'm redacted. I can see it. You can hear. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that's it. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> it's almost a show. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> you forgetting the color of the shoe is not as redacted as me just straight up not listening to the, <laughs> the title and then thinking they're somewhere. They forgetting are. the no cussing sign. <laughs> yeah, literally listening to cuss words and not hearing them. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's uh, break. Take a piss. Let's move on from serial killer talk. Sorry, everybody. <laughs> you got a pee pee. Yeah, <laughs> I'll I'll take over. I'll I'll keep it. I'll keep it going. <laughs> what are we doing? Are we rolling still? If you want, <laughs> if you want, Let's roll. dude. <laughs> what are we doing? The show's still going on. <laughs> if you feel like it, dude. You want people to watch this shit besides homeless cats and me and Gerardo? <laughs> Get a grip. Strap the fuck in. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, dude. I watched the whole episode of T Fat K this week. Oh yeah. Yes. This one. Um. No, I don't believe it was this one. Oh. I watched the one uh, where they were talking about Shab's uh, street getting flooded. Oh, from the Hillary? Yes. <laughs> that sounds like a lie, too, doesn't it? Uh, yeah. I mean, there was not a lot of flooding in the Hillary. We, uh, If you aren't in Los Angeles, most parts of LA didn't get it too bad. My girlfriend did have her car flooded. Her car smells like shit. Yeah, that's, uh, I mean, she was farther out. We won't say yeah. where, obviously. East, but yeah. Yeah. But uh, he was talking about how his, his streak got flooded, and then Brian's like, well, come on. Be cool, dude. Like, uh, Hawaii's on fire right now. <laughs> and then Bri- Brandon said something to the effect of, like, well, Hawaii would, like, feel for me or be, be empathetic for my street. <laughs> 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 something <laughs> like that. I forget. I just had it on the background when I was playing video games. Yeah. That, I, so, wait. Brian said that about Hawaii comparing. He's like, don't compare. Don't complain because Hawaii's got a bad. Yeah. Brian, Brian was basically saying like, come on, dude. Hawaii's got a really bad right now. You complain about your street B. Brian's trying to earn points. He's yeah. like, listen, I care a lot. Yeah, okay? he did look at the camera and go. And he goes, Afghanistan. Or yeah. what's a word? Honolulu. Yeah. <laughs> but it's not Maui. The Banyan tree. <laughs> yeah, he cares a lot. Yeah. Uh, on the look away, woo woo. I probably cussed a lot in Hawaii. I don't know. <laughs> Israeli come a Hawaii. Okay, guy. Akuna Matata. He brings out a guitar. <laughs> All right, let's see the rest of it. What else we got? We have uh, any uh, current events or whatnot? By the way, while we're talking, everybody, and you were listening to this, you're in San Antonio, anywhere near that. You come out to the LOL Comedy Club because <laughs> I'm bringing heat. Wise guys, September one and two. I had my. Uh, Son, do a promo for me. For I me. saw it. It was very funny. On your Instagram? Yeah, watch. Go, go to my Instagram. Uh, <laughs> he's Dude. eating. He's talking about a show, <laughs> and he says, "Go to my Instagram." <laughs> um, that's crazy. But uh, I have a show on the sixteenth at Fourth Wall. Oh, you do? Yeah, I gotta go. Oh, <laughs> you're not gonna piss yeah. right now, dude. <laughs> I fall. <laughs> you're redacted. Redacted. <laughs> but I do have a show. You do? On the 16th. Oh, I have yeah. a show, dude. I have a show on uh, September 23rd. It's gonna be a fucking dope ass show at Studio M. Hell yeah. ECMO Podcast Live. Oh, yeah. I've been on one of those. Yeah. It's a little crazy there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Dude. Cheap drinks Motor alert. and good stand up. Uh, all right, so, uh, you know, relative good stand-up. Let's see here. Uh, this one's posted by Haphazard. Oh, dude, more than 50% of t- this, today's clips has been Haphazard, dude. Thank He's him. really a numbers guy. He's one of our best, one of our guys. Thank him. Hit him with one of them, dude. You like his clips? <laughs> you like his clips, dude? Yeah, you like him? Yeah, yeah. Thank him. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I feel I couldn't feel more redacted than I do right now. So that's good. One more. Boner alert. (laughs) I want to watch the cursing clip again. Oh, man. Okay. You want to pick? I'll get that one. I'll pick that one back up. Yeah. All right. So this one is called uh, He Still Opens with This Bit from Chin's latest vlog posted by (laughs) Haphazard Boner Alert. Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) What's going through his mind right now? I'm going to crush it. <laughs> I am the <laughs> I'm the best ever UFC guy to try comedy ever. Yeah. <laughs> Boner <laughs> alert. <laughs> or what is uh, what is Mr. Whole Foods <laughs> stick? He's just like saying his stupid lines in his head. Chili rayon <laughs> carne asada. <laughs> he pre- he practices <laughs> The words like we do our songs, like he's memorizing and stuff, so he can do it in one take. <laughs> Seven times a week. <laughs> he's standing behind the curtain going, 
Oh, look at how he's dipping his nacho and his nacho cheese, dude. What the <laughs> fuck? Dude? Redact, redact, redact. <laughs> redact, redact. Let's see. Oh. Pause it for a second. I do. I don't know if I've ever told this story about Shab, but another comment came up to me. And he said he saw Shab, I think it was the comedy store, and he brought him up, or uh, Callan brought him up. He, like, introduced Shab, but the mic stand fell over, so Shab comes out, and he, like, huddles with Brian, and he made Brian bring him up again. What? Yeah, just to pull up the mic. He's like, dude, just pull up the mic stand. I don't even know it was Brian, to be honest, but he's like, like, put the mic stand up. So they're like, introduce him again. They're like, all right, you guys, Brandon Shaw from the TFK or whatever. Isn't that crazy? Yes. Why would you care that the mic stand fell down? I will say that it's one of my uh, pet peeves when a host doesn't put the mic in the mic stand and hands it to you, right? Oh, no. But no, it's not okay. You just deal with it. You don't yeah. fucking stop the whole show and get it back up there again, dude. Yeah, yeah. I'm just saying, you know, devil's advocate, baby. <laughs> All right? Why are you going to look at me like that, dude? I know. I'm just like, it doesn't really, I don't think I care. <laughs> it doesn't really. bother you No, not really. <laughs> I need to go back to therapy, dude. Yeah. <laughs> look at this guy's face right here, dude. <laughs> yeah, so right in the camera, dude. Diamond balls bags, deep dude. into the camera. If you uh, if you zoom in, that might be uh, that might be me, dude. Imagine <laughs> I opened for shop without even knowing. It'd be amazing. Oh, sorry. Ladies in the crowd tonight. What up, Phoenix? Dude, he can't <laughs> what up, Phoenix? Dude. <laughs> what up, Dallas? <laughs> Phoenix is a little different. Phoenix is a little different. <laughs> if he does that, that'd be amazing. He should do that every time because that would be so funny for yeah. the cats. <laughs> yeah. I'd really love that. That'd be amazing. A compilation of that. Yeah. <laughs> that's the guy, dude. That's the guy that's having the worst night of his life. From the clip that someone posted on, or the picture, <laughs> the picture that someone picture, posted yeah. on the chain. He's like, I can't believe I'm here. I thought that, who did he thought it was someone else? I thought this was Brendan Cooney. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I wish. Nobody knows who I am, Bro, who, am he, I, who I are. He looks twisted. This guy is, is all about it. Oh, yeah. He's thick boy. He's the gang sign. C-clamps almost. Dude, yeah, almost C-clamps. He's got both pistols in this guy, baby. Yeah. He's with his he's with his little Mexican right there too, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. This white guy right here is not digging it at all, bro. No, no. <laughs> Look at this guy staring in the camera. <laughs> that guy is for sure on Changs. <laughs> that guy looks like he freaking created Changs. <laughs> that's all I do is lie to you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's all. Hey, we found him. <laughs> Ever heard of him? <laughs> he's drinking on the job right now, dude. <laughs> It's all homeless people. It's all like that's haphazard. He flew from Canada. Haphazard, haphazard is somehow a Latino man. Unlikely. Oh Unlikely God, after interviewing dude. him, but minimum sky. That could be haphazard. Yeah. <laughs> this this is uh, <laughs> <laughs> This is Ryan Joseph. Yeah, Ryan Joseph 82. Yeah, he's like <laughs> about to edit. He's like, I'm going to edit something from this. That this is all I do is lie to you. Do you already say that? <laughs> the black guy is all I do is lie to you. <laughs> it's so funny to say that they're all cats, dude. This is no a minimum sky right here, dude. Yeah. Oh my god. Shit just throw slitters right here, dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, let's keep let's see the ending. A lot of dudes in there, man. <laughs> a lot of dudes. Hey, in yeah, there. I'm the bro whisperer, dude. <laughs> It's real cock fest. Oh my god, hurry. <laughs> real cock fest. <laughs> real Ooh, cock fest. Damn, in dude. Here. So that's the line he's talking about. Wow. Oh my god, dude. All right, keep yeah. talking. I'm gonna I'm gonna pull up that other clip. I mean that was awesome. Yeah. That's one of the best that's the best clip uh in that was my while. favorite of all the ep the whole episode for sure. Yeah. He's still using it. Yeah, it's all. It really is like he doesn't. He's this unaware may, completely. Yeah, of what's going on outside of his little bubble. Yeah, there's a possibility that that's true. Probably not though. Probably not, bro. He, he just doesn't care. He just goes. Yeah. Well, uh, that guy George has been on the. Or his name is George, right? The the fat dude that lost weight. Yeah. Uh, he's been on the subreddit just commenting stuff. That's interesting that he does that because you'd think that Brendan would be mad about that. Yeah. Even if it's like, you know, 
maybe he would tell him. Brandon would be like, "Listen, I don't mind just posting ghosts, please." You know, <laughs> as long as you don't respond after you comment. Yeah. Uh, all right. Well, this is uh, back to the original clip. Uh, the bit that he takes yeah. too seriously. Yeah. Let's see what this is about. It yeah. sound inappropriate, but I got a boner that could blunt a cat's claw. You know what I mean? Uh, I'll tell you yeah. why. Because Brennan's wearing a little biker cap, and it makes his head look extra small. <laughs> and let's be honest, the top of his head is extra small. Is he extra doesn't have small. much of a brain. You know what I mean? <laughs> He's got a big body with a small head and a tiny dick. You know what I'm saying? All right, guys, let's hear it for my boner right now, which could cut a diamond. I don't know why, but I am hard as it gets. And speaking of hard... I'll take you from here, Pilot Fish. <laughs> How about you suck me off at the commercial break? Yeah, don't... <laughs> don't call percent. Second. They haven't so, cussed once. Yeah, they didn't cuss. So I'm, okay. I feel less redacted. Uh, you know what? But they did say dick. Yeah. And they said boner. I, I guess you maybe don't. <laughs> boner, suck, dick. You know what I mean? <laughs> suck, dick. Yeah. So they're, but this is like, I think that they're right and you're right. Yeah. Uh, but that's such a childish thing to do. Like, oh, we can curse again. So let's do loud, goofy curse voice. Yeah. That is like. The that's the main issue, the problem with their show is that that they would do something like that. Yeah, it's so bad, it's terrible. Let's but see I want to see if they think her. I think they do watch. Hey, a pilot fish, you stupid son of a bitch. There we there go. go. There, <laughs> there we go, dude. All right. So yeah, I mean, I still feel redacted. Obviously, <laughs> it would. I would anyways. But I just want to. I mean, the amount of cursing that there wasn't, I feel redacted. You know what I mean? That I since I didn't listen to the title and I didn't know the clip, yeah. and two two clips in a row. Um. I my brain went to Brian. Yeah, is like thinking about because it's like the beginning sounds like he wrote it for us. I still think that, <laughs> um, but then it's no, it's this stupid bit. Really, man, if you just think too much about this shit, you get so stupid. Oh, or yeah. maybe that's just me. Yeah, but no, I feel really dumb. I see. I agreed saying yeah, but I don't mean yeah. I yeah. think y it'll be hard for you to reach that level. <laughs> <laughs> right? It's like reaching Nirvana. I'm like. <laughs> It's like a Buddhist thing, but I'm becoming like a full on read act. Yeah. Like I was dumb when this started and I'm even more dumb now. Yeah. But you like are sort of like Zen about it. Maybe like I don't, that hasn't affected you as much. Oh, it, it's affected know. me, dude. I'm watching TFK at home. <laughs> yeah. You watched a whole episode <laughs> by yourself <laughs> and it's not any of these clips. You didn't yeah. do anything with it. You didn't yeah. like pull anything. Yeah. You just watched it. Yeah. I didn't even do it on earwaves. Yeah. 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 You're a fat fucking whale. There you go, dude. Yeah, this is for sure the curse bit. <laughs> I mean, I thought that already. Yeah. Because you explained it to me. But. And you're going to die soon. I'm going to outlive you. But you've been you following this whale, you pilot fish, and I'm getting sick of what it. Is pilot That's true. Fish. I don't, dude. What, what I don't understand is why they're cursing all the way at the end. Like, if it's the bit that they have pre scripted or pre thought out, they waited all the way to the end of this. I guess it's a clip that's been edited, right? But. Like, why wouldn't you? And why does he keep not cursing? I think what well, the speculation is that they're like they went a week with redacted no cussing rules. Right and now they're like, let's get back to the old TFAK. My dick can cut diamonds. Boom, 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 boom. Uh, you're a fat fucking do, dumb, dumb, this and that, whatever. There we're doing a bit voice is, is real stupid. Yeah, they got to yeah. rethink it, dude. <laughs> they got to go back to the blueprints here. But I'll be dancing on your grave, you piece of fucking shit. You're a <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, but honestly, I think I've only counted four cuss words, you know, right. so they are cutting back. Yeah. Big old mud pie, you overgrown whale. <laughs> I hope you sink to <laughs> the bottom. Let's cut the brakes. Because they care too much about numbers to fully commit. Yeah. They care too much about the, uh, the YouTube rating algorithm to fully commit to the bit. <laughs> oh, well. Well, we also care, but not enough to have a bad ending. Goodbye. Wait, here goes one more time. See you later. <laughs> Boner alert. I looked at the wrong camera. <laughs>